All right, everyone, welcome back to the channel. Taking a quick look at Luna Classic here. Since the last time we looked at it, I think it was back here. Uh, this thing's been absolutely ripping to the upside over the last couple of days. So congrats to all the Luna Classic holders out there. Uh, what to look for now? Uh, there is no overhead resistance at the moment. So the 1618 is your next stop, as you can see. So you're looking at about a 12% move to get up here to 30216. Uh, if you do end up getting up that high, so just keep an eye out for that. If we get past that, then of course the 2618 up here at 30298 would in fact be your next stop. Like I said, there's no resistance for this thing, so there's really no telling where it's going to end up going. So if you do get up to the 1618, you could potentially have another 37.5% move up here to uh, 298, so just keep an eye on that. Um, we'll have to see what happens with this thing. But if you did top out where you are now, your first line of defense, I would say, is going to be down here at the 786. So you're looking at about a 25, well, let me move, almost a 26% move down here to 149. And where I have this green box right here, uh, I would say this is going to be your new uh, support level if it does, in fact, come all the way back down from where it is. So you're looking at about a 31.5% move down here to 13.8. But... I would say 13.8 should be your new bottom if this thing does come back for some consolidation before another leg up. Uh, but other than that, just kind of watch those couple of prices there on Luna Classic. Uh, you can see that it is still in the over uh, bought area and it's curled up on the uh, stock RSI there. And it's extremely bullish on the Heikinashi candles here. So yeah, everything is looking very uh, healthy and good for Luna Classic at the moment. So we'll see how high this thing can go. Uh, maybe we can get the whole world to FOMO in and this thing just rockets to the moon. Uh, but we'll have to just play it by ear and see what happens. But yeah, uh, not financial advice. Thanks for watching, everyone. And peace out.